So in today's episode of Mon Buzzle, we actually might know what we're doing. That way we can turn over some big profits and we can upgrade a race car. And also, I have a surprise waiting outside my house that I'm hoping is done. So if you guys are excited for more Mon Buzzle, be sure to hit that thumbs up button and let's do this. Hello, audience. You're probably wondering why am I in the house uh, at like 5.30 in the morning, just kind of sitting in my bedroom. Well, today's the big day. Supposedly, my garage is built. I haven't seen it yet. I was asleep. I woke up, and I'm excited because we did that last episode. Uh, so, oh boy. Actually, we need that light because we have uh, no electricity right now. Here we go. Ready for the garage. Wait, what? Oh. Oh. I oh, this is going to take several days, isn't it? You know, I kind of expected this to be built. This is going to be big. Like, look at this. You could fit at least two cars in here. That's not bad at all. There's going to be a door here. It looks like you have your window frames all through here. How many days does this take to do? Well, poo, that was my plan here today. Well, I guess my other plan could be uh, to go work in the uh, sugar shack a little bit. I got a couple things I can actually uh, do and accomplish. And uh, we might have to skip a couple days and uh, see what happens to this garage. Well, the sun's coming up. Uh, let's go ahead and fill this bad boy up here. That way we could try to fill up a barrel of uh, maple syrup. Might still be a little too cold for those pumps uh, to be working. I want to check. Has the tank level gone up and out, dear? And we... All right, here we are. Question is, can we make some maple syrup today? I'm kind of hoping that's a thing. Okay, check the pumps. I don't hear them running. It's probably still too cold right now. Yeah, it's too cold. They are good to go. I'm going to actually connect some more trees to this uh, here eventually. But uh, if you recall from last episode, here we go. Where's my... Oh, there's my barrel. All right, so this is the barrel. So let me look at this operation real quick. Okay. Obviously, the tank's out here. The tank flows into here, so you turn this valve on. And then it goes into these, which I'm assuming gets heated up by firewood. Then drips into here, and then drips into here, and then maple syrup? Uh, yeah, that's a thing. All right, so let's do this. Let's make this operation work. So let's go check the tank levels. Uh... Yeah, it's definitely gone up. Okay, so it was below this little black line, or this little uh, bottom of the tank. It was about right in there. So yeah, definitely gone up. Here, let's grab some firewood real quick. So yeah, at one point I was trying to heat up the pumps outside with the torch, thinking, oh, it's just because they're cold. You just gotta you actually put flames on them to heat them up, right? And yeah, there's a lot of things I do wrong in this series. But like I said, I only really rely on the comment section. I do not like to watch other YouTubers play this game. Uh, because it's like a fresh experience for me. So if I seem confused by things, that's why. All right, let's dump this real quick. I know one of the to-dos is to actually fill the sugar tank up all the way, but we're not to that point of the operation. Like, we need to make some return on this now. Now, when we uh, got a bajillion trees hooked up, then yeah, that'll be a thing. This is definitely filling, by the way. Okay, how far does this go up? Are we going to get a full barrel? Okay, that quit running, so let's go ahead and close that valve. That way, once those pumps uh, start up, they'll be good to go there. Get a couple pieces of paper into here. There we go. Okay, let's light this puppy. Boom. All right, that's lit up there. Oh, that is a lot of flames. Close that. So we are building up pressure or temperature. What is that? Whatever it is, it's heating up. Okay, so that's going to start doing its thing. Do I need to do anything with this? This just requires electricity, I'm assuming, which we have technically attached to the shack. I definitely hear a bubbling noise. I guess that's the sugar water bubbling. So yeah, it's the sugar or sugar water from the tree. Uh, you bubble it and stuff or peat it up and I guess it, it's evaporated through. I don't know what's happening to be honest with you. Uh, we'll just know when we, wait, is that maple syrup? Hold on, let's watch this level. Dude, that's totally going up. We're making maple syrup. Okay, uh, let's make sure we got enough firewood to keep this fire fed. I don't know how long it takes for this to burn out, but we are officially doing it, folks. Okay, it looks like there's still plenty of fire in there. I'm going to toss one more in there for good measure. There we go. All right. That's good to go there. Nice. So how do we do this? Do I just... Oh, is that filling? Uh, do I need to take this here? Let's stick that right below it. Ah, uh, we're not wasting product. Wait, where's the product going? Oh, it is going in the barrel. All right. Uh, let's just drain that into there. 
So that's pure maple syrup, right? Nice. This is cool. All right, well, I'm going to keep that valve on and let it keep spilling that sugar into here. And hold on, let's check the fire. Okay, the fire's definitely gone down a little bit. Let's go ahead and kind of make sure this is good to go. Uh, throw some extra firewood in here. And we can go be productive somewhere else. Uh, throw a couple of those. There we go. Nice. Uh, all right. Close that door. So our operation's just kind of running itself right now. Uh, we'll come back when this is a little bit more full. And we'll see if we can get almost a full barrel of uh, maple syrup. So yeah, it's still honestly pretty early in the day. So I'm going to go ahead and just do a little grinding away at uh, collecting some logs, splitting them. Uh, we'll take a load over to the brother's house and maybe we'll get an update as to how long this uh, this garage is going to take. Uh, yeah, I definitely would like to see it finished this episode. I don't know if that's going to be a thing. As long as it doesn't take like 20 days or something. I'm hoping like two or three maybe. Okay, here we go. Selling some firewood. Got $69. Yeah, I'm really curious if uh, we can get a full barrel. Like, I don't know if uh, you lose the barrel. Let's go talk to our uh, brother real quick. Hey, you got to finish this garage? Uh, I want more friendship with you. Uh, how you doing? Gosh, I hate cutting firewoods so much. What does that even mean? Just go build my garage. Either that or I'm going to steal your truck. All right, let's go talk to the store owner pointlessly. Because, uh, like I said, we need 25 friendship with him. And then we finally get access to the junkyard. Hey, what's up, buddy? Hey, don't forget to take a maple syrup. I know, buddy. All right, let's check our friendship. How far are we away again? Okay, we're really only 12 away, and you can only do it one a day. Uh, so, yeah, 12 in-day games. As long as we do it every day, we'll be good. Uh, it's kind of a pain in the butt. It's fine. All right, good sir. I'm going to take up some more of these uh, sap spouts real quick. So, this tubing post, I think, actually extends uh, how far you can uh, run some of those trees away. So, we'll get that. We'll get a hose. Uh, we're gonna make this a bigger operation and wait electric auto heater. So this is something I can buy too I think this will make it where you don't have to use firewood and then uh, I don't oh it boils 50% faster. That's what that does reverse osmosis and of course the can sealer which is extremely expensive So yeah, we need more sugar water So I definitely need to get another set of uh, hoses and sap spouts hooked up to the machines and then we should be good to go there Look at how productive we are today. Like, this is one of those episodes. Komodo doesn't mess around. Like, I want a successful business and a successful garage. That way, I can build the best car ever. Okay, let's see how full this barrel is. Uh, go ahead and let that happen. I need to go cut some more firewood. Uh, see how full. 25%. Yep, it is filling this bad boy up. I want a full barrel. Like, I'd like to see how much we would get for that. So, we're definitely going to have to make this uh, work for us. So let me go ahead and get the uh, operation running again uh, before we set up the new stuff. We'll probably wait till tomorrow to set that up. Plus, hopefully the garage is about done by then. You know, I'm really not sure why my character likes to wake up at like 5 in the morning. This is fine. All right. Well, we are ready. Oh, there hasn't been any progress made. What is my brother doing? Do we need more firewood or something? Do I need to go talk to him again? Uh... Okay, well, that's a thing. I'm a little disappointed to wake up to that. But what I'm not disappointed to do is the whole fact that our uh, our whole maple syrup operation is a go. All right, here we go. Pull the handle. Okay, so we got fuel out here. I think we're good. Let's go ahead and we'll head over to the shack, uh, get it running today. We got to set up the new trees. And I'll wait another in-game day, and I'm hoping that we're going to see some sort of uh, progress on this garage. Okay, so I'm trying to look at how to expand this operation or change it up. So I've got these posts in here. Uh, is that three-way or two-way? Hold on, let's see where we can stick this. I need to actually branch off into the, the maple trees over here. So if I were to stick this post, uh, what's the closest thing? Maybe right here? So I can hook into these, right? These little spouts. So what if I were to divert this? Instead of going here wait how do i grab this out uh do i need to have the other hose in my hand i gotta figure out how to get these out okay so i have the tube now okay so now i can remove these so where's our post our post is there so here let's remove this tube here and this one's going to be run to the post so i should be able to hook up all around this bad boy so here we'll put this one out can it only do two connections i'm not really sure can i fit come on oh no you gotta be kidding me 
Uh, that's bad. Okay, so I got another spout uh, that maybe I'll be able to use here. Let's remove this spout. Oh, it's tube is connected. You have to do this in a weird order. Okay, our loop is about to be connected again. So here we go. We got a loop connect it. Okay, so we have the spout over here. So we should be able to uh, maybe connect a few more. Okay. Let's try to put this right here. Cool. So we're going to have even more trees connected. It's going to be like a big old uh, maze of maple trees connected all together and pumping out all that sweet sugar. Well, would you look at us? Boom. There we go. We got more trees connected now. I'm pretty proud of that. Not going to lie. All right. So this is going to definitely fill this up. We'll just uh, store all this under here. Uh, still too cold right now, but uh, we got this going. Okay, let's go ahead and start that up there. All right, can confirm it's flowing in. And let's go, we. There it goes. And close this. Okay, that should be closed off there. Just in case it isn't, make sure this is right under it. All right, we are back in production. So yeah, we have 14 maple trees connected. It still says kind of bad, but we'll be able to get more trees here in the future. Uh, I'd like to set up another post right about here and then connect all these trees over here at least there's three or four over here that we can connect ah uh, look at that 100 percent on the barrel all right okay so we are good to go we got 100 percent on the barrel here we're gonna take this and sell this today and we're gonna let this tank build up uh, i'm just gonna leave it running uh we are good yes finally you know there's a chance i've had my turn signal on for like two episodes i kind of feel like i just want to keep it on now because I know it's going to bug some people and more people will comment on the video. <laughs> oh no, what's wrong with me? Okay, so we are going to take this and sell it. Let's see what kind of money we are going to get. So I don't know if we get the barrel back. So obviously I'm hoping it's at least, I don't know, $400. And then I had to buy a new barrel. So technically $200 made. I mean, it'd be nice if it was more than that. I don't know what a barrel of maple syrup gets you. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. What is gonna happen here? Look at the money. Look at the, oh, wait, why did the money not go up? Okay, maybe I have to actually put this into the uh, the thing here. All right, let's do this manually. All right, here you go. Full. Boom. You'll be paid each Sunday for a couple weeks. Wait, come back the next business day to get the barrel? Wait, so I got $200 there and then I get paid like in payments for a couple weeks? Holy man. Okay, that's totally worth it. I also want to say hi to my buddy in here. Hello, buddy. So yeah, we'll get our barrel back in the next business day. So tomorrow we can pick it up and begin to start the process again. Like, this is so efficient. So eventually you would probably just want to go buy another barrel, which I'm going to let those tanks build up. I could have probably just bought one there, but there's really no point because I'm going to let the sugar tank build up. But man, I finally feel like we're playing the game right. All right, I got to get some fuel real quick. Oh, geez. And say hi to my buddy in here. And we're going to wait one more day to see if that garage pops up. All right, folks, it's the next day. We are ready to go check and see. And oh, look, there's a roof on it now. So this is totally just taking like maybe like two days at a time. So hopefully next episode we'll have access to the garage. Uh, we'll make some more syrup, make some more money, and eventually upgrade this turd. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time.